Welcome, Scorpio and Cross Watchers. This is your general love reading. Scorpio, I feel like you are... Um, You've got your sights on somebody. You're coming in as Empress Energy, but you have your sights on somebody, but they're not your emperor. They're somebody else's. So stick around. Let's see where this goes. Scorpio, let's get into your energy. Then we'll get into the energy of all 12 signs. Then we'll get into your reading, and then we'll get you some clarity. So with that... Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Scorpio. What does Scorpio need to know? You're manifesting strength. Okay. So, let's find out what's going on. So, Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance. What is the energy of all 12 signs around Scorpio, starting with Aries? If you're dealing with an Aries, somebody's very unhappy in something long-term and committed. If you're dealing with a Taurus, somebody is, I feel like they're working with an option here because there's options, illusion, confusion, or daydreaming. I don't feel like they're daydreaming about working or they're d confused about working. I feel like they're they're working with an option here. If you're dealing with a Gemini, it's taking somebody a long time to move forward. If you're dealing with a Cancer, someone's obsessed with anxiety. So there's somebody's got devil energy here this could be an obsession but they're anxious very up in their head sleepless nights i feel like about something toxic or obsessed with with their anxiety so they're they're trapped in their own anxiety or their own head about a situation with you scorpio if you're dealing with a leo someone wants justice to offer their love so they want they want to they want to be with you really bad Scorpio, if you're dealing with a Leo. If you're dealing with a Virgo, someone's making a head over heart decision about the King of Swords. So someone who's strategic, not showing emotion. This person's making a head over heart decision to cut something out. And I feel like he's very um, detailed in what he's thinking and how he's feeling about something. You know, they don't show their feelings, but they're very logical, but they're strategic about it. So plotting and planning. If you're dealing with a Libra, someone's walking away and ending something. If you're dealing with a Scorpio, this has to do with a king of coin and an empress. So the king of coin being a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, and the empress being a Libra, Cancer, or Taurus energy. I want to find out what what that has to do with those two. Not speaking, using your intuition, keeping secrets, the high priestess. So you may be trying to There's a king and a queen of pentacles here. So someone could be married to somebody, but that there's an empress here as well. So, not speaking, using your intuition, keeping secrets, queen of coin. So this may have something to do with you being put in a third-party situation, Scorpio. So, if you're dealing, if you're dealing with a Sagittarius, they're hiding something. If you're dealing, there's secrets. There's secrets with Sagittarius. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, someone's blocking someone and moving on. If you're dealing with an Aquarius, there's deception around you. Scorpio, coming in as the King of Cups, there's deception. So if you're dealing with an Aquarius, you may they feel like you're lying to them. There's deception around you. And if you're dealing with a Pisces, 
This is the emperor's energy wanting a new beginning in love. So you may be this, you may be the empress to this, this Pisces. But you may be dealing with, you may be dealing with um, somebody else. You may be dealing with a karmic. You may be the empress in this case, and you're not speaking. You're using your intuition because this person's hitched. I feel like you could be the empress in there, but your true match is a Pisces here. So it's not going to resonate for everybody, but Pisces is the emperor's in love, a new beginning in love with an emperor for a Scorpio. You're manifesting strength in this, in this case, okay? So let's get into your energy and find out what's going on. Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Scorpio. Why is Scorpio manifesting strength? Why is Scorpio manifesting strength? So I feel like if you reconcile with somebody, Scorpio, you're expecting equal give and take in a reconciliation or a judgment here. So somebody's out in the cold for a long time. So someone's been out in the cold for a very long time here, and they're unhappy and wanting justice. So whatever this judgment is, if it's a reconciliation, you're wanting you wanting to be given equal give and take in this situation because you've been out in the cold for a long time, unhappy, wanting justice. Block someone's trying to block a decision. Trying to block a decision. Something ending, something ending where they feel very stuck and bound. Holding on or holding back Queen of Coins. And the Queen of Coins came in the energy of, of Scorpio. Um, so let's find out why what's really going on here, okay? I can scoot these over just a little bit. Obstacle here. Let's be patient. Oh, someone's trying to win at all cost. Playing mind games. A new passion, a beginning. So I feel like Scorpio, is that your energy? Are you the one who's being patient about winning? A new passionate beginning with somebody? You're manifesting. You're manifesting a new beginning in love. Empress energy. Let's see what's going on. Are you the queen of pentacles here or are you the empress? So that's the question. You're manifesting strength. get some clarity for you holy spirit angel spirits and guides clarity and guidance for scorpio what does scorpio need to know what does scorpio need to know somebody breadcrumbed you or you want equal give and take what is the six of coin here for please so you're working on having equal give and take in this situation. Someone wants to reconcile and have justice. So you want reconciling justice. So I feel like you're wanting the judgment to fall in your favor here. Whatever this is, you're reckon you, for you to have the judgment and justice. That could be a divorce. That's what this is. Scorpio, the energy of the other Scorpio that you could be dealing with. There was a king of pentacles and a queen of pentacles. Someone's working on equal give and take because they want somebody to get a divorce. Justice and judgment. 
a final just a, a final judgment and justice would be a divorce. Okay, so you want somebody to get a divorce? You want somebody left out in the cold with the with the uh, five of coin? It's clarifying the five of coin. So you want somebody to be left out in the cold for a long time, making a decision. So you may have been left out in the cold for a long time and you've made a decision. You're discontent, feeling very trapped in your, your head, sleepless nights, and you're very guarded and defensive when it comes to justice because you want equal give and take. You're, you're demanding equal give and take in a situation. So I almost feel like your energy is that of the Queen of Pentacles. So let's get more clarity to find out who. Okay, so you want somebody blocked and walked someone may have blocked you and walked away now they're making a head over heart decision to reconcile or this is you there was an ending where somebody needed to heal and the eight of swords the eight of swords very very trapped up in their head can't get somebody out of their head queen of swords being strategic not showing emotion Discontent about this third party. I feel like somebody's discontent about a third party. Queen of Wands and Emperor. See. You have an Emperor and the Queen of Coin here. I'm gonna get some more clarity. Who is this who is this Queen of Swords? Master and their emotions for you. Okay. So you feel like you're very up in your head about a queen of swords. Whoever this queen of swords is, mastering your emotions, you feel like you're their true match, not this person. So you're very, you feel very trapped in a situation where there's somebody trying to come between you and your person. You're unhappy about a third party. Looking back at the past, the mistakes that were made, I feel like with your two of cups okay so you have the queen of pentacles and the emperor why is the okay someone's going to speak the truth that they haven't been why they haven't been speaking oh queen of coin emperor energy and the truth is coming out not speaking using their intuition keeping secrets and illusions Someone's going to tell the truth about why they did magic on somebody. They're speaking the truth to the emperor. It could be the emperor doing the magic, or you're speaking the truth to the emperor of why you did magic on him and somebody else. Because you felt like you were their true match. Okay? So, you do have temperance. I feel like, oh yeah, you're, you're trying to... Be patient so that you win and have a new passionate beginning. And the Ace of Wands is here twice because somebody's obsessed with sex. Look at this. There's an obsession with sex. Okay? You're taking the time to win the Queen of Pentacles. Offering discontent. Wow, Scorpio. This energy, you're... you're um, I don't see the empress doing that. I honestly don't see an empress doing this. Okay. This would be something a karmic would do. But somebody's obsessed, a new passionate beginning, obsessed with the, someone could be obsessed with the queen of, of coin. This could be, uh, but I feel like, I feel like the obsession is sex. Okay. Queen of coin wanting to offer our apology discontent. Somebody's unhappy. There's an offer of, for somebody, you want somebody to be unhappy. You're trying to win. You're trying to win against the Queen of Pentacles. Because you feel like this person's a true match. You could be, there could be, you, you're doing magic on somebody because they're with the Emperor here. 
the truth about not speaking or using their intuition, keeping secrets of in illusions, keeping secrets and illusions here. Manifesting a new beginning in love, Empress energy. Okay, so you want the 1111. Someone's very trapped up in their head about the Empress. Ten of Cups. Single and abundant, waiting. Someone's still waiting to win, making a decision to move forward. I feel like you're waiting to win for someone to make a decision to move on. And 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 uh, under the under the deck, you have this King of Pentacles, brokenhearted about ending, watching. A, a juggling, trying to understand something about moving on from a relationship that made them happy to begin with. So, for a new beginning, Scorpio, I feel like your energy, I don't even know. I, I mean, this is about, this is about a queen of pentacles and an empress, but somebody here The the empress is trying to manifest a new beginning and love in a relationship, but very trapped up in their head about an empress. Ten of cups, that's single. So my question to you, Scorpio, the best I can get out of this situation is because you feel like this is your person. Because you're you're coming in an empress energy, but you're also coming in trying to win against a queen of pentacles. Okay, but here's what my question is to you. Yes, you may be an empress in this case, but I think you're fighting for the wrong person. I feel like I feel like the emperor is meant to be with the queen of pentacles here. And you're you're letting him know that you're doing magic on somebody because you're fighting. You're trying to fight for them to walk away. You want them to walk away because you think you're their person. But I feel like you are an empress, but I feel like you're fighting for the wrong emperor. I don't feel like this is your emperor. I feel like this is their emperor. And I feel like you're trying to make somebody walk away from their person. But I feel like you're... And that's why that came up in that energy. The energy, the energy for Pisces was that that's the emperor was Pisces. So I feel like you're fighting for the wrong person. Honestly, I feel like I feel like you you're maybe a you may be a, an empress in this in this scenario, but this emperor isn't your emperor. There are other emperors out there. You may feel that quality with that person, but I don't think it's your person. I feel like you're trying to get somebody else's emperor, and you have your own waiting for you to figure that out. So let's get into this and find out why. That's kind of odd. I've never had it come out like that before, but that's what the energy I'm feeling is you're fighting for the wrong person. Good for you for fighting, but I feel like, I feel like you're fighting for the wrong person. And blessings and career life purpose and trust and beauty okay trust and beauty okay forgiveness compassion and freedom okay is manifested here okay freedom and justice manifested so i think you're going to figure out that this isn't your person because what i'm getting here is that you know, your blessings and your career, your money, your blessings, your money and your life purpose. You know, you're trusting the process. You are pro trusting the process. I feel like you're fighting for it, too. Um, beauty. OK, um, this is your inner beauty, not your physical beauty. But somebody is wanting freedom here, freedom, compassion, forgiveness, and they're manifesting justice. So they're manifesting justice because they're not your person. Your person is somebody else that's waiting for you. That is of equal caliber to this person that you're fighting for. But this person specifically is not your energy. You have somebody else that's in your energy. And you have to recognize who that is. And you may not uh, have had that awakening yet. You may not have figured that out yet. But you're going to. Because you feel like this person is your true person. 
but your true person's a Pisces, Scorpio. If this is your energy, then he's a Pisces. I'm just saying, you have to, you have to see that. So Holy Spirit, Angel Spirits and Guides, Clarity and Guidance for Scorpio. What does Scorpio need to know? Somebody's manifesting justice here. But see, up here, you're wanting this person to divorce this person that they're with. They're already with somebody that there is their is their divine partner. But you're manifesting a divorce here. Okay? You're manifesting justice here. Um because pride and ego is in the way. Pride and ego. You're being guided to return to where you need to be because somebody else is admiring you. And it's been a lesson for you. It's been your lesson. It's been your lesson to figure out this. Okay. Um, and, and I feel like you're getting connected with that inner child and knowing your self-worth is going to bring you into union. So refocus. They're saying refocus. Refocus. You're with the wrong person. You're you're focusing your energy on the wrong one. So interesting reading, Scorpio. That's all I have for you. If this resonates, please leave me a comment down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I hope you have a wonderful week.